Hello, hello, Tracy Blim with Lazium Mind Body Health and the Ignite Your Life Systems. Today we're going to talk about why best intentions are not enough. We don't need to have a strong intention of where we're going and where we're headed and what we want in our lives, but an intention is just not enough. It can sometimes have you running east when you're looking for a sunset. With best of intentions, you need to have, yes, focus, you need to have leverage, you need to have drive, but the most important thing I find missing from people is training, and it's a lack of willingness to invest in yourself. So what happens is, and I did this too with one of my first businesses, is I was so excited, I kind of went out there and got going and customers were coming in and all of that, and then it started to crumble and crumble hard. It was costing me a lot of money. There was no profit. It was very difficult to keep it going, and so I didn't. I actually had to stop that business and go start another one. And the reason why is because I didn't know what I was doing in business. I knew how to offer the, the tool or the service, but I didn't know the basics of business. Now, I'm not saying you have to go to university and get a business degree, but there is training out there that is usually very unique and specific to the business that you're building that can teach you exactly what you need to know if you are coachable and if you are willing to implement and stick with it. To become wealthy is very boring because it's just figure out the system, rinse and repeat over and over and over again. If you are trying to um, lose weight, you need to invest in the training to learn how to do that. Buying a book, uh, starting a diet plan that you found online typically is not enough. There's a mindset component to it. There's an exercise component to it. There's a prep point to it. Some of the best trainings I've had were, okay, this week you're gonna focus on this, make it a habit. This week you're gonna focus on this and make it a habit, and they layer it up. That training was worth every penny. Uh, if I wanna learn how to do Facebook, well, I will take training. If I want to learn how to run a marathon, I will take training. If I want to learn how to play music, I take training. So where is it right now that if you were to invest in yourself, invest in the training, could create an amazing life, it could create the wealth you desire, that kind of investment in you is the best thing you can do for your family because what comes up when I say that is, I don't have enough time or I need to spend my money over here. If you invest in yourself, you will make more money, you will have a greater life, and you will have that much more to share with others. So, what three questions do I ask when looking for the training? Truth, is this the right instructor? Truth, is this the right time? Truth, is this the right course? If I don't get a yes to all three, I don't take it because I know everything happens when it's supposed to, and I will look and find what's required to get me to where I need to be. So. Hopefully this adds some inspiration to you to get those brain juices working and you figure out where you can invest in you to create that amazing, amazing life. So I would love for you to subscribe, become part of the community and tell me where you're going to invest in yourself in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. Enjoy the rest of your day.